All right, YouTube, what's up? I am going to teach you how to make string out of a plastic bag. All right, so let's jump right in. First, you need a plastic bag. And what you're going to want to do is just flatten it and um, kind of flatten both corners and smooth it all out and get out any wrinkles. And you want it to be completely flat. Next, you're going to want to cut off the bottom edge and try to do as straight as possible, but we'll cut it again later. You're going to flip it around and you're going to cut off the handles and try to make a as straight as possible clean cut line across it. Now you're going to want to open it up and flatten it out again so you have a, a big rectangle. So now you just put it on its side and you're going to fold it in half first. Line it up and flatten it and smooth everything out. And now you're going to fold it in half again. And one last time. Now you're going to take an X-Acto knife and a ruler. And you're just going to cut off any excess where it's irregular. You're just going to cut it off so it's got you got a nice clean edge. So just make that cut. And now um, I'm using two squares, which is one inch on my cutting mat. So I'm cutting them into one inch, one inch thickness pieces. You just set them to the side and just keep cutting and you're going to continue take your time to get the measurements right and continue cutting these little one inch thickness pieces all right so now you take one of the little plastic strips and you're going to wrap it around each hand. Wrapping it around, like wrap it around the left hand, wrap it around the right hand, and just stretch the middle. And be careful to not stretch too far. And you just stretch a little bit, and you'll see that the plastic bag will transform into kind of like a string. And you might have a little bump in the middle. And if you keep stretching, it will smooth out. I mean, you want to stop there to um, avoid snapping it. And you can move down and you can continue stretching very carefully and you just move the string along and you can I think in smaller spaces it you can uh, stretch it without it breaking and you kind of stretch it out and then move your fingers in closer and continue stretching and if you do this a lot I would recommend um, wearing gloves stretching stretching and so what you're gonna notice is yeah if it snaps it's totally fine simply um, stretch out if you need stretch out a little excess and just make a little knot and so here I'm showing you you just make a little just a simple knot and after you make the knot directions and then just cut off the excess and as you as you work on a project you can usually put it anytime you have these little knots on the wrong side so you can hide them all right and then you keep going and so you're gonna want to end up with um, a large loop a large circle so here I have one of the large circles and then once you have a second large circle you can link the two together to start to create the string. So you see, I just have two loops and I take one and I overlap it over the other. And then I pull that up to the top 
and I put my fingers through there and grab the string that's below and pull it all the way through and pull it tight and now you've linked together two larger loops. So then I take it the place where I put the knot and I carefully go down taking out any knots and keeping both strings side by side until I get to the very beginning. And I'm gonna take that, it's a little loop, and I'm gonna wrap it around a pencil. And I twist it a bunch, a bunch, a bunch of times, just to kind of make a, to secure it to the pencil. And then I wrap it around. So you just keep wrapping, wrapping, wrapping around the pencil, and then you have a little loop that's there. Then you um, take a rubber band and wrap it around the pencil so it doesn't unravel. You really want to make sure you do this because it's annoying to have this all tangled. So now you can add future loops that you make. There. So this is a little sample. This is um, a little square that I made crocheted. Here are other little samples. This is a shoe that I made with the, the plastic string, and these are other small, tiny prototype shoes. Here, this is the sneaker. This is the upper of a sneaker. Yeah, these are all, all made out of plastic back string. And I will make a future tutorial on this uh, coming soon. And here you can see some detail. I used a really small crochet hook. All right, so here's my shoe, my little samples of string. I'm really excited to see what you guys are gonna create. Please like, subscribe, share. Thank you.